Excuse me, sir, I ordered the double decker. So today for our Beyblade show, I have this incredibly heavy double-decker base stadium. That's not the name yet. I'll get to that in a second. My father's going to explain what this is and the process for it. It's really heavy, but uh, yeah, let's listen. Hi, everyone. So I'm going to try to explain uh, the concept of uh, what we did. So originally we had um, this uh, stadium, 24-inch wide with 4-inch dip. And uh, we want to bring, so we have two different ones, one with four inch and uh, one with six inch dip. So we want to bring a little bit more excitement to the battles. You know, everybody d did their own version. So we want to bring based on the idea, of course, of us who did the battle tower. So we want to create something different. So what we did is we replicate the bottom stadium and I know you guys are gonna ask where did you buy, where did you order, so let me make clear. We live in Toronto, Canada, so we contact some plastic manufacturers and uh, it's difficult, most of them are not interested to do it. And so finally we found one was willing to do it. Uh, don't forget the round part, it's hard to cut, is manually cut. So they did the first one so after we thought to do a second one and uh, with the, a 10 centimeters like four inch uh, hole in the middle so each blade is less than two inches like five centimeters so at least they can fall down and go on a second level to battle and um, so we had some difficulty to be made uh, actually they made one wrong was shorter and uh, what we did is uh, so the difficult was to, to connect one stadium to the other and uh, this stadium is connected with uh, four pieces of um, uh, four inches like 15 centimeters if you metric like we are in canada so we bought this bar this is acrylic this is a long bar because they don't they don't sell small pieces you have to buy the whole bar and cut four pieces to glued the acrylic glue one to the other and to be able to to do the purpose of the dual layer stadium and uh, as you can see they fits proper so uh, each Beyblade is two inch, less than two inches diameter it's 10 centimeters so we already did a, a few test paddles and they're they're amazing oh yeah, yeah, yeah. okay so i can handle it from here so um that was the process so the uh, people mostly get it so there's a clarification right off the bat we basically explained everything so first thing before we continue right so obviously we're gonna leave the bar right there you know saying you drop some bars kappa okay so um what we actually want is that we don't have a name for the stadium yet right we don't know we thought i, I was going to do a joke where it's like colossus battle tower just like merging two Hasbro names. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna do sort of like a little mini, I guess like a contest slash giveaway. So whatever is the most upvoted nickname for this double decker huge anime real life base stadium, will get a gold winning Valkyrie Lair. Comes with the stickers and a QR code that's for the Takaratami app. Oh, there's no QR code? Oh no, yeah, yeah, no, yeah, there's no QR code. So just the lair, my mistake, because I keep on thinking there's QR code for everything. Yeah, for the name we're gonna take. So it's really nice. If you ever wanted a winning Valkyrie lair that's gold, now's your chance. Most upvoted nickname for it uh, will be the winner. I just wanted to do this too, just because I don't know what to give it a name. I don't want to just say, you know, Colossus Battle Tower. That was like the last idea as a joke. So what we're gonna do, right? So we have these Chosy Bays, but before we like, continue, I want, I'm gonna do some practice launches. I'm gonna do some little trick launches, see what we can do. And then after, what we'll do is we'll just do some random battles because I have like all these shows eBay's. I might even get the random boosters. But we'll just do some battles. We'll see how they react to the stadium because we were trying it before and it's crazy. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. And um, I'm gonna do a few test launches. I'll do test launches with each of the bays and we'll see where we go from there. We got Fornius now. Three, two, one, go, shoot. Okay, Fornius, yeah. 
All right, so I'll do a few practice launches because some of the stamina type base, they just go straight down to the middle. Sometimes you try to like do like a... Yeah, you see that? Yeah. So the cool thing about this stadium is that they kind of ride around on the hole. So the good thing is if they're both on the top layer and one of them rides around the hole then comes back out, it's good for like a little sneak attack on the top. So try it one more time with Fornius. Three, two, one, go shoot. So it's really cool because an example with this is that um, it'll ride down, but sometimes it'll kind of use it as a ramp to dive down and do like a strong dive attack. So that's what I really like. And of course, the scene has been done before, either official or through fan made. The good thing about ours is just that it's really big. So I'll do another one. We're at Z Achilles, right? So three, two, one, go shoot. So with Z Achilles, it'll dive down. The cool thing about dive down attacks is they'll dive down and it'll actually even make it burst. So what I'll do is actually I want to make sure this shot's a little bit wider, maybe move this a little bit back. Yeah, yeah I'll zoom in. So what we're going to do is I'm going to do it again. So three, two, one, go shoot. And then look at it. It's down to the second level. So I'll try one more time with the Achilles. So three, two, one, go shoot. Again, dive attack, right? So that was the Achilles. So we're going to get my favorite one. Not really. That's a joke. Crash Ragnarok, because this one's very weird without reacts to it. I don't know if it's going to burst. Three, two, one, go shoot. Yeah, so sometimes if I'm lucky, if I don't do it crazy, I'll just go straight down. But if I try to do a side launch, like three, two, one, go shoot. Ah, uh, there's one trick I'm trying to do, which I want to do, where it's basically it rides around the hole, but I'm not sure if I can do it. We might have to try it again. So three, two, one, go shoot. Yeah, it's tough with this one. It might also be a attack type base. Basically what happens is that the one time that we did it, it legitimately just rode around. So I'm gonna see if I can replicate it. I'm gonna try to do this. Whoa, crash track around, don't do that. So let's get it on. Three, two, one, go shoot. Yeah, okay. So Crash Ragnarok, there you go. Maybe when we do the battles, that we'll see it happen. So next one, which is an attack type bay, it's winning Valkyrie. Amazing. So three, two, one, go shoot. So there's a, you know, normal dive, you know, normal dive down. Yeah, like I got it. So I'm gonna try to do a side launch now, see how that performs. So three, two, one, go shoot. Now you see, that is what I was talking about and how it will be like crazy try to go down the middle, then it'll burst. So that was winning Valkyrie. So we're gonna move just now to the longest because I don't wanna make it too long where I'm just like showing like these weird tricks that I'm doing because I actually wanted to get to the battles. So night up, uh, I mean, bloody longest. So three, two, one, go shoot. So the good part is about this one is that sometimes for the battles, it'll go like all the way around, they'll maybe clash a bit. And bloody longest is a little bit difficult because like it, it's, it's afraid of heights, right? Because, like, you know, it's a dragon. It doesn't want to get down. And then it drops down. So, unfortunately, it's sort of like this. Bloody Longinus is good because on the top level, it'll get all the hits in. But when it dives down, it gets really weak. So, I'll do one more launch, and then we'll get started. I'll do, like, random matches. So, three, two, one, go. Shoot. Yeah, because you got that. Because then after, if I get winning Valkyrie... Just as an example, you know what I mean? Yeah, because then you have that. Oh, it did it! Look! <laughs> it did right around. Oh, we didn't get to see it too much, but that was the example. So now what we're going to do is I'm going to do, well, actually, I'll get all of the Chosey base because I'm not going to just like stop with just the regular ones. We'll do random matches with all of them and we'll do, I'll do up to two points each just with this deity. Ah. It depends. It depends how many matches there are. I'll count. So actually, you made a good point. I want to show off the god base in this stadium just to show how they perform. So we'll first go off with B. Kukulkin, obviously. So three, I'll just do one test launch for each just for the god base. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. So look at that. You know, Kukulkin goes around. It doesn't, you know, it wants, oh, you see that? It rode around. And when it rides around, it gets a good attack on the top. Then after it dies back down. So that was Kukulkin. So I want to show that right away. I did pick Regulus because I feel like when it crashes down, it's going to do like a little bounce like nothing. So let's see how it performs. So to Regulus, three, two, one, go shoot. Okay, well, it's a soft landing. 
But that was pretty cool, you know, with Regulus, you know, a little bit of a dive down, a little bit of a bounce. We're gonna stop Regulus. We're gonna move on to our next bait. So I might be thinking, who is the next bait? Well, I'm gonna tell you, it starts with a drain and ends with a Fafnir. So Fafnir, three, two, one, go shoot. So you see that? It's a little bit of a balance. And the reason why we're saying it's more or less to the next level is that because one, it's two big stadiums on top of each other, one with a hole on top. And because it's not, it's like really strategy because it's the technique of how you launch it, how you angle it to see which one drops first, which again, it's more or less the concept, but it's just with a bigger stadium. So that's why it's a little bit different. So that was Fafnir. I just want to show that one off. Uh, we're going to go to Requiem. The one time I got it right. Well, it's in left. I meant like uh, the, what, what's it in? So obviously attack type, Frazetta, three, two, one, go shoot. So, you know, Rec Recreon wants to go around a bit. Re Rec Recreon wants to, like, travel. And then... Oh! Ah! That was Recreon. Now, probably what's going to be my favorite one, it's uh, God Valkyrie uh, with Ultimate Reboot and Strike God Chip, but it's... Uh, I want to see how it's going to work. I want to see if when it drops down, the Ultimate Reboot takes effect. So, three, two, one, go. Shoot! Okay, well, my question just got answered. So, all right, come on. Wow, the ultimate reboot kicked in right away. So what I'll do is that just to make the matches a little bit even, we'll do God Bays against Cho Z Bays in this stadium. Because now not only is like anyone could burst, but anyone could get to the middle and have the advantage. Oh yeah, also yeah, why, why not? So just battles. Um, the max I'll go for is only up to four bays. That's the maximum. So... It could be like um, 1v1v1, it could be any of that stuff. Loot Bay's there so you just see. So we're gonna set up and uh, we'll get started. So each point is going to be one point. Do you know if it's a burst? It's one point. So we're gonna do a few matches. So Crash Ragnarok versus Beat Kukulkin. I'm not gonna count self stadium KOs. Three, two, one, go shoot. Oh, did you see that? Look at that, a trick shot attack and I come back in just to save some stamina. Yeah. You thought Kukulkin was gonna win? Kukulk trash. Actually, no, I love this face. Oh, no, I take it back. I'm sorry. Oh, a few hits? Yeah, take a seat. Take a seat, because Crash Ragnarok just beat you with one to nothing. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Oh, I just dropped. Oh! Okay, well, it's one all. Oh. Wait, yeah, driver, driver battle. Come on, come on. Oh, my epic mod just lost. <laughs> All right, jokes aside. So... You see that? That was an awesome dive attack. It's one all. So I'm gonna assemble my bay and we're gonna do another round. Three, two, one, go shoot. Oh, you dropped in? Well, guess what, buddy? Cause I'm gonna win. You can't beat me. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty, one to two, one to two. I guess I lost. We're gonna move on to the next matchup, which is... Mark Muhammad against winning Valkyrie Random Booster. Three, two, one, go shoot. I dropped in. Are you gonna drop in, buddy? Are you gonna drop in? Oh, it dropped in, it dropped in, but guess what? I still got some smashing attacks! That I lost. <laughs> Plot twist. Alrighty, so awesome. So zero to one. Three, two, one, go shoot! Oh, come on, yeah, you wanna drop down? Yeah, come on, oh, you're scared, ah! Oh, you see that? Don't mess with me! Back off, yeah, buddy! Yeah, Ark Bahamut? More like Ark Balkesh, be gone. Three, two, one, go shoot. I'm down, buddy. Are you gonna come down? Oh, you came down. Welcome to the second level. The population is the two of us, but it's about to become one. Eventually. Take your time. Yeah, a few hits. A few hits. I'm gonna win. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna win. I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna actually lose. Bahamut, don't do this. Come on. No, no. No. All right, one to two. Next matchup, I guess. I go versus Free de La Hoya. Three, two, one, go shoot. Oh, we both dropped down. But guess what? You're in Iga's territory. He's gonna become the number one blader in the world. Cause I'm, cause I'm, cause I'm probably gonna win. I just gotta hit it a bit more. I was expecting one of them to burst like right away. I guess not. I guess if I'm gonna try to ride around the next round. Let's see if that works. All right, zero to nothing. You know, Fafnir stole a little bit of my stamina. I'll make it up in the next round. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. 
Oh, I'm down? Oh, and I got a good hit at the start. Come on. Yeah. Look, we're pushing the bay back. Oh, it's stealing my stamina. This is actually crazy. This really is the next level. You're welcome. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah, that's my welcome. I lost again. All right. Uh, uh, yeah, it is zero to two. We'll, go, we'll move on to the next pair. We're likely gonna see this matchup in the anime eventually. Winning Valkyrie, two and Nemesis, three, two, one, go shoot! Ah, oh, I got one hit in. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm, look at this. I'm camping on the top. Yeah. I'm waiting for a dive attack. Are you ready? Come on. I was just joking right there. Come on. Yeah, I'm just playing around, man. Playing around. Yeah. Hit it. Come on. I was just warming up for that round. Zero to one. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Oh, yeah. First hit goes to me. I'm gonna win. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Yeah, you see that? You see that? We did switch the base, so I'm gonna count that as one all. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Oh, oh my. Did you see the the bay went to my side? You okay? Oh my god. So obviously, this is so epic and powerful that no, humans cannot survive this. This is the extinction. I'm feeling a little bit of an adrenaline rush just for trying to find the lair and just that happening. So I'm gonna go for a really powerful launch. Three, two, one, go. Shoot! Oh! The sacrifice! All right, I, wanna, I don't care. I want to do one more round. Let's try it. I'm going to win. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Yeah! All right. All right, so enough playing around. Pass me that layer. Enough playing around. Now, that was Twin Nemesis against winning Valkyrie. We're going to move on to our next pair. God Valkyrie against the Achilles during the booster. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Oh, did you see that? I rode around and I got a good hit in. Yeah, come on, we can do it. My ultimate reboot kicked in. Ah, not enough. Zero to one. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Yeah, I got a good hit in. Come on. Yeah. Awesome, one all. Next round. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Yeah, buddy, I just dropped down. Oh, you're trying to do a sneak attack? Nice try, buddy. My reboot just kicked in, and, and and now I'm in the middle, so never mind. Have a nice day. Wait, look at that. Look at that. Oh, well, God Valkyrie. Nice. Next pair. We both have Zeta. Oh, we both, well, yeah, we both do have Zeta. It's Emperor Fornius against Sprig and Requiem. Three, two, one, go shoot. We're Okay, I see how it is, buddy. This is like early Shu and Fubuki training. Master versus student, early early video preview. Theory. Ooh. I'm absorbing the base, so that's like, that's the positive. Yes, yeah, so I don't know. Like, uh, do, do, we, do we think Fubuki maybe had a, a Fornix before Zeta? I don't know. Type in the comment section below for my ultimate anime theory. Oh, I'm actually gonna lose. Yeah, no, that was this pay. Yeah. Alrighty, uh, so is it one go? Shoot. Oh, come on. Yeah, okay. Don't worry, buddy. I'm about to do my special move. Requiem! Slat! <laughs> this, this is the, this is the... Slash. <laughs> Alrighty, uh... Alrighty, one all I guess. Three, two, one, go. Shoot! Yeah, come on, but oh! Now he drops down! Alrighty, Requiem, come on! Spe spe special Avatar, move Requiem slash! Yeah! Look at that! The axe came down! Oh, Zed is both in attack, by the way, if I didn't mention that. <sighs> I'm probably gonna lose. No, it'd be fun if I actually win, actually. Nah, classic subversion. Alrighty, so we're gonna move on to our last matchup. He's gonna use his favorite bay, Emperor Fornius against Bloody Longinus. Let's see how lucky I get. And this time, we're gonna go up to five points. 
Oh, okay, you want to do that? Alrighty. Three, two, one, go. Shoot! Oh, yeah, okay, buddy. Don't worry. Don't worry, buddy. I I'll be up here. Yeah, you relax. You relax, man. Yeah. Relax. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Because we want to drop down. Yeah, watch out. Come on. Come on. All right, yeah, let's try it again. I'll try to do a forward launch and see if it works. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. Never mind. Have a nice day. <laughs> yeah, don't worry, man. Just wait there. Yeah, and no, I'll come down. Yeah, just wait there for me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Watch out! Because cause I'm going to lose. All right, don't worry, don't worry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This was just a test drive. I'm going to get it for the next we one. We switch up and use the base. Three, two, one, go. Shoot! Oh, we both dropped! Yeah! Look at those hits! Come on, Fornius, crush it! Getting good impact on the bay. Fornius is the bay where when you play with it, you like you're always a winner. Alright, let's do another round. Three, two, one, go. Shoot! Come on, buddy! Yeah! You're not gonna mess with me, I'm Fornius! You wanna know what? Hold on, let me see what happens. Actually, you all know what? I'll try it out. So you know what we're gonna do? Because I already got these comments, so just to show that I listen. A lot of people have been really requesting that we get, uh, what was it, the regular Longinus driver and we just use Spiral. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to grab my regular Longinus. You're gonna hear some background noise right now. And what I'm gonna do is I'll give it Spiral and I'll try two extra rounds just with it. So, I don't know. We'll try it with this, try it with this, and we'll see how I Three, go. Three, two, one, go. Shoot. There we go! Come on! There's a few hits, but I still want to see how well I do. Will I win? Yo, am I gonna win? Oh, almost! Let's do one more round! Three, two, one, go shoot! And now I'm about to drop down! No, drop down, man. It's okay. Nah, what are you doing, man? Now, now you're hurt. Now you're leaking. Now nah, we'll do an extra round. Oh, you want to launch a net? Okay. Let me click before we go. I just want to see. Reach your longer. Shoot! Hey, come on, buddy. Drop down. Yeah! You can't beat the unstoppable Fornius. I'm a tank. You're nothing. You're nothing to me. Be gone. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm gonna win. I thought I was gonna get a few more toxins. That'd be a spin finish. Yeah, okay. So that was our mate. I don't even know what the name is because we have that contest. So, wow. I love this stadium. I'm de So first off, I want to put this disclaimer before we continue. We're obviously gonna alternate with our stadiums. We're not gonna just like use one stadium forever because we always want to try to innovate, try to change it up. So might, we might use this one, we might use the one that's really damp, we might use the regular one, maybe regular stadium. We'll always alternate. So again, name contest, whatever's the most upvoted. I don't know, maybe by in like a few days, or maybe the next video, we'll address the winner, we'll say who it is. But again, winning Valkyrie, gold winning Valkyrie lair for whatever's the most upvoted nickname. So good luck, I guess. So that pretty much does it for this video. I hope you smash that like. Let's get this video past a thousand likes for the hype of this stadium. Like, look at this. My arms are very small. I can barely lift this, but you can hit that like button. Uh, share this video with your friends. And for every, uh, for every, uh, yeah, like I said, just the uploaded entry uh, for the nickname. So yeah, that pretty much does it. My hand hurts from lifting that because this stadium is awesome. It's heavy. Stay tuned for more awesome stuff. As always, have an awesome burst filled day.